before we start, please hit the like button, subscribe and hit the bell to get our latest notifications. That way you really help our channel grow uh, and to getting you great content every week. Hey guys, welcome back. Today, I'm gonna to show you a few options uh, from Adrenaline Workshop for installing either your GoPros or other cameras onto uh, your helmet. Uh, we'll know that uh, they have the uh, regular sticky mount uh, options that you can mount in pretty much all the helmets currently in the market or some of them. And, and all of those are listed on each mount type when you go to the drop down menu uh, to select the one for your camera and for your helmet. Also, they have another solution for other cameras. If you have a cookie roller mount, you can use that with uh, uh, camera mounts for Insta360 or other types of cameras that are not specifically GoPros. So all these options you can find on our website. This is for the Insta360 that you can use with the roller mount. You see it has the bottom part like the roller mount. You just use the, the bottom part that attaches to, uh, to the helmet and holds that there so you can pivot it. So you can use this if you already have a roller mount for your uh, camera, but you also have a different one. Uh, or if you're looking for an upgrade uh, to use with your current uh, roller mount on, on your GoPro, there's also those versions there. Another uh, mount they're coming up with, which you, we should have here in about two to three weeks, uh, could be less than that, but that's probably uh, uh, around the time we'll have it in ready to ship, uh, is a mount for the uh, FlySight um, GPS uh, auto ball tuner. This one, uh, depending on where you have, you're going to mount it. Usually, these are mounted on the top part, on the back part of the helmet. Uh, but you will need to download a uh, template, a curvature measurement guide. Uh, but basically, you just print this out in 100% uh, uh, size, and then just cut this part out. Um, I recommend cutting it out and putting it on top of like a little cardboard and cutting out the shape. That way you have a, a, a firmer um, curve so you can match it up to your, to your helmet. And depending on what measures, you can compare that to what uh, we have on the website for options and select the proper one for you. Again, it depends on where you're mounting this and um, what type of helmet. Uh, every helmet has a different curvature, so you have to measure that just to make sure it's uh, the one that you need. But you'll find more details and the equivalents for each helmet if you scroll down to the description of the product and uh, check there. Uh, again, these uh, stick with um, usual 3M adhesive tape, which is really uh, holds really, really well. Uh, so it's not gonna like fly off uh, and the altimeter actually holds under pressure there So it's not gonna be uh, either bouncing around or, or sliding out of the mount uh, by any chance So this is a really good option if you're mounting either your cameras or your um, fly side audible uh, Check it out. We have these at shootingstar.com ready to ship uh, But if you have any questions about it, keep, shoot us an email, give us a call and we'll help you and walk you through it So let me show you where you can find all these mounts uh, there are variations uh, in the in the flight side GPS mount on our website. So let's flip the camera and let's go step by step where you can find these. So when you go into shop cameras, it's got to have camera gear, it's got to have helmet mounts. You can find all the mounts that we carry. Uh, you select the Adrenal Workshop option on the menu and you will be uh, you'll see the two options the low pro mofo gopro helmet mount which is a sticky mount which you can find in different configurations and different camera applications for different helmet applications uh, you select the one that you need from the menu and the type of helmet and you're good to go uh, if you are looking to get the roller mount application then click on the low pro mofo cookie roller mount camera housing it's just basically the housing part that attaches, as you can see here, to the ac the actual existing roller mount hardware, uh, and you can use these with GoPros, uh, with um, the um, Hero Max, uh, even the uh, Insta 360s uh, cameras, and different uh, types of uh, other um, point of view cameras that are out there in the market. So uh, yeah, here you are. You can find these, and you can find more details in the description of each one for the low pro mofo cookie roller mount housing for the fly sight mount from uh, adrenaline uh, workshop just go into skydive equipment go to altimeters altimeter mounts 
and you can just select Adrenal Workshop from the menu on your left and that will basically narrow it down to that fly side mount. Click on the category and then you need to select the size for, or in this case, for what type of helmet. Uh, and then the mounting type, if you want it on the rear below the vents or on, the, on top of the vents. And it will show you, as you select the option, it will show you a different picture so you can have an idea of how it looks on the helmet uh, for the top or the bottom. Uh, more details here in the description for the fit and the size equivalences. Uh, but yeah, this is basically how you order the one. Here is the equivalence for each one so you can have an idea. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it.